too loud. Uh, Alright, welcome back everybody. I'm sorry these videos have been a little bit spaced out. I um, recently was hospitalized, still got my little tags. I personally feel that if you take these off beforehand, you're bound to get sick, so I just let them stay on until they fall off. I um, have quite a few questions to answer here, so I'll go ahead and get started with them. Let's turn around here, pull this off. Um, dig up your vagueness of my zombie knowledge. Your your awareness is completely forgiven. If you don't know, you should check out this book. It's called How to, I think it's called How to Survive a Zombie Attack. I sat in this bookstore one day and just read the whole thing. It was freaking hysterical. It was an entire book of different tactics and weapons and just how to survive a zombie attack. It was freaking hysterical. Definitely worth checking out. I learned a lot from it. Some of it I already knew. But definitely worth reading. Um, You asked me if I could be any mythological creature, werewolf, vampire, zombie, Greek god, etc., what would it be and why? I would definitely have to say I'd like to be Poseidon. Because I'd be so freaking cool to just wash up and like, you know, mm, I'm really mad. Ooh, and send a wave after and just destroy an entire city. I think that'd be pretty sweet. And plus, you know, talking to animals and being a god, you guys, those guys get to turn into anything and screw people and just go right back into their... That's amazing. Um, Liv sent me a message saying, riddle me this, if the world was ending and you could save five people, who would you save? I'm going to be clever and answer that cleverly. I would say, I would say my fat girl, because she's amazing. I would use one of the people for her. I would say... Mm, you, of course. I'd save Josh and Jacob. And I'd save my last person. The freaking genie from Aladdin. I'd bring everybody back because I'm just that awesome to think that up. And then you ask me how awesome you are. And it's definitely like... Here's the normal scale. Hopefully this is in the shot. This is the normal scale. And you're definitely like up here somewhere. Um, and then Josh. I honestly find this funny that you asked me this question. If you could kick one person in the nuts, who would it be? I wouldn't... I don't like kicking people in the nuts. Because that's just wrong. That hurts. But I thought it was funny that you decided to ask me that question because it brought up the memory of you and me playing hacky. And I was like, hey Josh, do you want to see this neat trick? And you're like, hell yeah! And then I grabbed the ball with my toes because I never wear shoes. And I took the ball and grabbed it and I swung my leg back and I was like, boom! And I threw the ball and hit you right in the nuts and you just dropped like a sack of potatoes. It was awesome. And you were cracking up on the ground like, It was pretty sweet. But yeah, I thought that was funny. I, I would say I would kick anybody nuts because that's just wrong. But I definitely threw a hacky sack up in nuts because that's fucking hysterical. So, um, hopefully that answers you guys' questions. And stay tuned because I think tonight we're going to have a glow in the dark toilet seat video. So I will see all you guys later. Let me set this down so I can do my trademark. See you guys later.